Hey, Lil Case here, and welcome back to the Simpsons Tap Down. Well, in the full swing of this second act so far going on at the moment in this Simpsons update, just started the second act, and of course, every act has a personal character. The character in the situation is Mike Wegman. It comes to the Mike Wegman Center. Every four hours, 135 and 15 XP, respectively. Socialism rating. Let's place down. Let's place down a center, shall we? Yep. This is nice. almost as exciting yeah. as Smooth Jazz. Hands up! Kaboom! Yeah, it's not Flanders! Oh my god, I can't believe I'm in the same mobile game as the great Homer J. Simpsons. Oh yeah, I guess it would be plural, because there's more than one in my, in my town. Mike Wickman, it's nice that I get a center. A community center type of thing. You know, I don't know if we got really much of that in the game. I know we've got a gym and and things of that nature in a community center, but not so this would seem like it would be like more like an athletic center. Alright, well, before we type Mike sorry, blah, before we tap Mike, we have to tap his center. I mean he's all about basketball and things of that nature, so I assume it's gonna sound like Somebody dribbling a basketball or things of that nature. Something sport related, I think. So we'll go with the sound of a ball being bounced and squeaky shoes on a court floor. <laughs> Teaching sports betting to the underprivileged. I'll be perfectly honest, I don't really remember the episode, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember what he does or whatever. I am Coach Lugash. I just know the person that voices him. And ain't one of the main cast members. Hey, Mike Wegman, how is the sports bed and pizza truck business? Oh yeah, I do remember that he got some kind of like pizza truck at the end. Homer J. Simpsons, the greatest mentor in the history of the mentor herd. Sniff. I'm not crying. I got something in my eye. No, I'm lying. I'm just so moved to be mentored by the greatest man in the history of mentoring. You're making me blush. I gotta be honest with you, Homer. Things are not looking good. Online sports betting is killing my book. And for some reason, customers would rather buy an entire pizza instead of eight individual slices. What is wrong with the people these days? Don't worry, Mike. Homer J. Simpsons and Tamako are here to save the day. Sniff. I... I got something in my eye again. Nah, I'm lying again. Can I move well with love and hope right now? Is it too late to adopt you and get rid of my other kids? Crying. It's never too late, you giant magical mentor. Ah, that's nice. Brainstorm business solutions and Mike lie about getting something else in his eye for the third time. I think we all know what's gonna probably happen. Maybe it'll surprise me. Well, of course, all the lights will turn on. Maybe we'll get some silhouettes as well. That'd be kind of nice. Now, it looks like... I don't know if the sign would light up, would it? Mike Wegman Center? Hmm. We'll find out. Oh, yeah, it's Pizza Truck. I wonder where they go if you don't have the Pizza Truck. Brown House? Almost, I'm on my way. Deep fried bedding slips? Your betters can literally eat their losses. What did they ever do to deserve such genius? They're crispy, but the frying does make the betting slips unreadable. I'm sorry, I've let you down, Mike. I don't accept apologies from Jorge Simpsons because he has never failed at anything in his life. Sniffs. Now I got something in my eye. Ah, that's sweet. Again. Drama business. First animation. I don't know what that means. So betting slips. That's, uh, that ain't banning slips. He's, uh, bang, banging a, a drum with a pizza costume. Maybe they'll still be banning slips. I don't remember if it even happened in the episode, blah. Can't remember. Now we got this metal donut. Mmm, premium currency. This lines up pretty well. 
Hey, there was homie. Was homie involved? He was. Go! I wish this was a shooter game. Oh, I sent him on the wrong quest. <laughs> I just tapped the first one without thinking. So yeah, he's banging on the drum. Where'd he go? Hello, Michael. I'm here for my slice. Are my pizza pie or my profits? They both come with extra cheese. I just want my cut of your money, please. Tony, I don't have the money. And I'm not going to insult you with excuses. I'm going to insult you by begging for mercy. Please don't break my legs. We don't break legs. Big sigh. What a relief. We start by breaking one arm. With intact legs, you can still drive, go to work, and get us our money. You thugs are very considerate. Thanks. I don't know about that, the driving part, but... Beg for his life, which is probably animated. It's not. And I clicked it fast without looking down below. Although I did see a quest, but I didn't see what it said. I don't know how to beg for my life, so maybe we could figure out over a game of pickleball. What the hell is pickleball? I don't know either. I just thought mentioning pickles and balls might distract you. Game on. Is that essentially just tennis, but like easier, like underhand sort of stuff? I really don't know, actually. I just, whenever I see pictures and stuff, it just looks like they're just doing underhand tennis, basically. Kind of funny. Online sports betting and full-size pizzas have killed my business, and now you're gonna kill me. Relax, Mike. We only kill horses and put them in your bed. But even that makes me yawn. So this time, we're gonna do something worse. We're gonna forgive you. No, don't! What? Yeah, wait, what? Pity him? Pity him? Getting soft, Fat Tony. Real soft, and I don't mean physically. Online sports betting is a juggernaut. On phone. I just parlayed the over-under on the Isotopes' game with the spread on the Adams' game and the number of cliches the coach is going to drop in the post-game presser. You're betting online? It's irresistible, boss. I don't need your pity, Tony. I'm going to find a way to save my business and get you your money. Storm's out. What's wrong with this pitcher? I forgot to tie him up, didn't I? If I'm going to save my business, I'll need the help of the one man in Springfield who is smarter than Homer J. Simpsons. Hush your mouth! Rings doorbell. Who is it? I mean, if we're talking about, like, logically, it would be, like, Professor Frink or something. But it's probably not going to be him because he thinks Homer is smart. So who is it really? Oh, it is, <laughs> it is him! It is, it is Professor J. It is, um, Professor Frink. So they did go logical on this. Coming, I'm coming in. I'm here. Professor Frank, I need science miracles to save my business from the online gambling and jerks who buy whole pieces. Hot slices with cheeses that pleases? Holy glavin. Exactly. This man gets it. I've got just a thing. So, Frank is going to show off his latest invention and Wegman try the Pizzatronic Pizza Maker. Ooh. Ooh, that's fun. If we can get it to work. Not really. I mean, it, it kind of worked. Ooh. Ugh. What was on that big slice? Looks like bubble gum and axle grease? I don't know what that brown stuff is. But he seems to enjoy it. So is this random? It is random. Maybe that's burnt guacamole or something. Wow, the lineup for your pizza truck again, Mike. Frank is nuts, but his pizza tronic is a hit. And now, people can bet on the pizza toppings they're getting. 
Pineapple ham at 40 to 1. Oh yeah. I parlayed that with a slice of sausage and anchovies. I want 60 bucks and a bucket of hot wings. Oh, so there we go. In the end, he doesn't have broken legs or broken arms. And he probably paid back Fat Tony? I'm going to assume he probably did. As for me, I've never done any sort of online sports betting. I barely even know the word parlay and what that means. But I had to figure out who can go to that center that we didn't even get a chance to look at. There's gotta be one of these though, obviously. Teach kids how to parlay, no. A shift for Homer, no. Hmm. Sell slices and take sports bets? I mean, I don't think he would go to his truck, would he? Let's find out. Yeah, he's going to the truck. And this is what it looks like, by the way, in case you didn't know. Very nice. But still, that doesn't help me. I tried the 24-hour quest, sell slices and take sports bets. But I think what it actually is, is going to be... Teach kids how to parlay, which would make more sense because of you know, a center, a community center type of thing. But yeah, I think all the lights will turn on. And I don't think the sign's going to lap, although I would like it to. So I think just the lights... We'll turn on, and maybe, maybe, some silhouettes. I see lights, a lot of lights actually, which I really, really like, but there is no silhouettes and the sign doesn't light up as well. I didn't think it would, but I had a, a glimmer of hope that it might, but it's not bad. I like the fact that there's a lot of lights. There, you know, you, you definitely know somebody's in there. So, four hour quest with Mike, setting them off about teaching kids to parlay, if I recall, if you want to send them on that, for this building. And that is going to completely wrap up the full walkthrough for Mike Wegman. So let me know down below, what did you think of this particular character? Again, if you don't have Mike's truck, does he go to maybe the brown house? Is the truck available? It might be available in, in the update. I'm not sure. I haven't looked. But I assume if you don't have it and you can't get it, or it's premium, then you'd probably have him go to the brown house or something of that nature. But maybe somebody down below who doesn't have the truck but does buy a mic can tell me. Subscribe for more tapped out videos and I will see you moving forward with more premium characters down the line and more in the Simpsons tapped out Simpsanos update. I think that's what it's called in the future. Bye bye everybody.